my fellow citizens, thank you for this opportunity to serve, and thank you for your insights, high fives, fist bumps, and obvious commitment to your communities, your friends and family, and one another. Your kindness and generosity are like oxygen for the rest of us. I've been able to do all this by finding common ground, by refusing to engage in the partisan nonsense that consumes so much of our national politics, and by putting the people of our Commonwealth first. And that's why I can stand here before you tonight and say without a doubt that the state of our Commonwealth is strong. <laughs> Massachusetts also leads the nation in procuring clean, renewable energy. But yesterday's solutions and yesterday's plans are no longer sufficient. We must continue to take bold action to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. So tonight, I'm committing the Commonwealth to achieving an ambitious climate goal net zero greenhouse gas emissions by 2050. We filed an $18 billion transportation bond bill last year, the largest ever. $11 billion would be invested in road and bridge improvements, with another $7 billion for additional expansion and modernization of transit, commuter rail, and bus service. Our 2021 budget proposal will include an increase of $135 million and operating funds for the T. The sooner we have access to both the tools and the funding, the sooner we can make our transportation system safer, better, and more reliable. Now yesterday, or at least it seems like yesterday, we enacted another groundbreaking education reform law during the first half of this legislative session. This is our chance to give every child in the Commonwealth the opportunity they deserve to be great and we should fully embrace it. We've demonstrated time and time again over the past five years that we can find common purpose, that we can lead and represent the very special people of this very special place we call home, that we can focus on progress, build on what we have, and live up to the ideals, courage, and appropriately high expectations of our neighbors. Let's make them and each other proud God bless this Commonwealth of Massachusetts. God bless the United States of America. Thank you.